Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, we'll be looking at the Insta360 GoTo Action Camera, which is the world's smallest action camera and allows you to take some incredible footage from all sorts of different angles, such as hands free, EOV footage, action sports, driving cars, motorcycles, and more. What makes this camera unique is how easy it is to create all sorts of footage without needing super expensive camera gear basically anyone can start doing it immediately so let's dive in and get some details i will do a quick unboxing to see what you get and then move on to a bunch of features of the insta360 go 2. all right so this is the contents of the box so you get the box you get a pivot stand you get a magnet pendant that you can put around your neck and then simply attach the camera onto it magnetically, which is gonna allow you to walk around and take some really cool POV shots, just like this one. You have the camera right here. You have a charging case for the camera that not only carries the camera, but can also charge it. You get a quick start guide and you have an easy clip accessory. Now again, uh, the products are all magnetized, so this thing on the back has a magnet. So if I were to attach to this any one of these accessories, it just snaps into place, which makes it very easy to transition from one accessory to the other. I'm gonna show you the different use cases in this video. So again, if I wanted to use this accessory, look at that, it just snaps into place magnetically. And then this is the carry case for the camera that charges the camera, and you can also use this as a remote control. You have a record button and a mode button right here. We'll talk about all that in a little bit. Let's start with the magnet pendant. All right, so here I have the pendant around my neck and you can see the diagram here faces forward. So this portion faces your body. And then what you have to do is you have to grab this and put it underneath your shirt. Now it is over here. And once you do that, you grab your camera. On the back, there's a magnet. So you grab that. This one has a magnet too. So look at this. It attaches right there. You position it properly. Now it is on your shirt and you can get POV style footage, no problem. You can just walk around and record anything that you want, any adventure, travel, vacation, whatever. And then to operate the camera is very easy. Over here, we have a button and over here under the lens, we have a LED light. So if you want to start recording video, you just press this once. You're going to see LED is going to come up and it's going to start to blink. That means it is recording video. When you want to stop recording the video, you press and hold for one second. And that's going to stop the recording. You can see it's going to get turned off. There we go. Now, you can also take a photo. All you have to do is double press this. Double tap, I mean. Double tap. And it's going to take a quick photo. So that's how easy it is to operate and use this product. I can also use the included pivot stand to simply stick it to my car anywhere I like, make adjustments as necessary, and the camera easily and magnetically snaps into the pivot stand, making the process so easy it's hard to believe. And then I can proceed to get some really cool driving footage. And like I said, you can place the camera anywhere on the car so it can have footage from different angles. So here I have it side mounted and you can see the footage gives me a brand new perspective. I can create some really creative content out of this. Now because Insta360 Go 2 is so small, you can basically attach it anywhere and they have an accessory for any potential use. So for example, if you want to record footage on your uh, motorcycle, you can attach it onto the motorcycle anywhere. I just bought this accessory here that allows me to do just that. And then I can go and have some fun and gather some incredible footage outdoors on a nice bright sunny day. After you record the footage, you're able to access all that footage in the actual app and you can play and preview them in the app. I'm going to show you guys more details about the actual app and its features in a minute. But just want to show you how to access your footage. The app is free and available in Play Store and the App Store. You can also use it as a selfie camera by buying an extendable selfie stick and attaching the camera on top. The possibilities with this thing are endless. The selfie stick will allow you to record wide, sweeping shots just like this one, smooth and fully stabilized. You can use the included easy clip to attach it to your baseball cap and record exactly what you're seeing as you travel, hike, go for walks, or even ride a bicycle, this product is very well thought out. And because the easy clip and the camera have magnets, everything just snaps into place. And then I can go and take footage just like this one and notice how I can record 
landscape as you saw in the previous examples or portray orientation as you can see in this example with this camera. Like I said, the possibilities are endless. Now, the reason this camera records such stable footage is because of its horizon lock capability. You can see I'm twisting the camera to record some footage in this nature setting. And now take a look at the result of that recorded footage. By enabling the horizon lock feature, I can achieve this locked state of stabilization. And it's a feature you can enable or disable. Now, earlier you saw me attach the camera on top of my car. Let me show you now how to use the carry case as a remote control to control the camera. Now that I have the camera mounted on top of the car, I can control the camera using the carrying case. You can see over here, we have the mode button. So I can record, I mean, I can choose which option I want to use. So when recording pro video mode, for maximum editing and then when I'm ready I'm just gonna press on record it's gonna start to record so let's uh, click that and get some footage you can also have the camera in the carry case and use it as a selfie camera so many potential combinations as if that wasn't enough the carry case also has a built-in tripod so you can actually place it somewhere and just record whatever you want they really put some work into developing this camera so once you have all that footage, you can edit that in the app. Now I'm going to show you guys how to get that done. So once you get all the footage you need, you can create a masterpiece right on the app and then share it with your buddies on YouTube, whatever. All right, so let's talk about the Insta360 Go To app. This is where you're able to do a lot of things with the footage that you've taken with your camera. So let's take this footage, for example, right over here. So that's just me holding the camera with a selfie stick, getting a little preview. Now I'm going to pause this for a second. I'm going to show you guys what you can do here. Uh, one of the biggest features of this camera is it has a super wide screen recording in all angles, vertical and horizontal. So on the fly, I can go from a 16 by 9 to a 9 by 16 aspect ratio. And it's going to actually include more of the person in there. As you can see, it now is showing the bottom of my body. But when I go back to the uh, 16 by 9, you can see it gives me a widescreen view. So even if you record in this orientation, when you switch to portray orientation, you are getting more of the screen. Or you can do a one by one if you wanna put it on Instagram maybe. And then you have options like trimming that video. If I tap over here, I can trim the video, make it shorter. Then I can tap on OK, and that's going to cut the video, make it shorter. And you have the options like uh, face filters. You can add a music. Uh, you can speed up the video. And also you can add filters just to make it cooler. Look at that. Uh, in this case, we are outdoors, so let's do an outdoor effect. And look at that. It makes it nice and colorful. And then when I tap on OK, I can tap on Export. And then I can choose the settings under which I do want to export. I can do custom or automatic. Tap on export. It's going to process and export that footage. And then I can share that right away on social media with my friends, put it on YouTube, whatever you want to do right from the application. So look, it is saved to the phone album. And at the bottom, I have all these options. I can share it immediately. Now, another great feature is if you go to stories, you can actually create a story of a particular day that you spent outside. Let me show you an example. So tap on create a story. And what I can do now is I can go to my video files here and I can select the ones that I want. So on May 5th, I was outside at the dock. So let's uh, pick a couple clips from there. I'm going to grab this guy right here. I'm going to grab this one over here. Let's grab this one, this one, this one, and this one. So that's six clips. I'm going to tap on selected. And what you can do is you can do a flash cut. So the AI will do the job for you or you can do manual editing. You have either option. Let's do the flash cut, see what happens. It's going to add the music. It's going to sort the clips. It's going to cut the clips. So let's see, it says processing. Let's see what it creates for us. And then what you can do is you can choose the length of the video. You can do a 26 second video, a shorter video, or a longer video. So let's go by the short. I'm going to tap over here. It's going to say processing. And the clip is now ready. So let's see what it did for us. Let's hear the video with the actual music. It 
So that's pretty cool, even though it's just an example. Imagine what you can do with the manual editing. Now, when I go back out here, let me just go back out. You can go to Explore, and you can look for tutorials, and they even have them listed by Easy, Intermediate, and Advanced. So, for example, with this camera, you can do this. That's an advanced umbrella spin technique. Let me just kill the volume. You can recreate exactly what she's doing right here. Okay, so there's a lot you can do with the app. And by the way, if you click on this button here, the camera is right now connected to the phone and it's sitting in front of me. So if I tap on this one right here, you can see we're getting a live view of myself. The camera is actually watching me. You can do that as well if you so desire. And that's it with the app. So this camera is incredible. I am impressed with what they have done. It is super small, easy to carry, easy to use, comes with an accessory for any type of creative shot you can think of, and has a great app to put your footage together and form a powerful movie clip. There will be links down below to buy it, and of course there will be special deals for Saki Tech viewers, such as free accessories and a good discount if you purchase using the links down below. So if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, also drop them down below and let me know. For now guys, have a fantastic day.